Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Data Cloud Now. We're currently in Davos at the World Economic Forum, and I'm joined by the one and only CMO of Snowflake, Denise Pearson. Denise, great to be back with you here in Davos. Couldn't be more excited <laughs> to be here with you, Ryan. Yeah. Denise, this marks the first year Snowflake is a partner of the World Economic Forum. Why was it so important for the AI Data Cloud to activate at Davos? Yeah, I mean, just looking at the uh, main theme of this year, collaboration in the age of intelligence. I mean, it, it's so aligned with the mission of Snowflake. I mean, we're all about enable that collaboration of data and also the accessibility of data, you know, as well. Very well put, Denise. And I have to say the Snowflake brand fits in perfectly with the ski town of aesthetics here in Davos. We're on top of a mountain. Branding is fantastic. And also Snowflake with their ski chalet. How will this help foster meaningful business outcomes over the coming week? Yeah, I mean, we have a much bigger presence here in Davos this week. You know, we have our chalet on the promenade. We have branding across the promenade as well. And uh, just a great way to also get a chance to meet with all our customers here or our partners that are here this week. Yeah as well. The power of the ecosystem indeed. Denise, I have to say your schedule is nothing short of jam-packed. How will you be participating in the various events and what's top of mind for you while on site? Yeah, this week, I mean, I've been participating in a number of panels, primarily on the topic of AI, of course. Uh, also met our customers you know, and partners and media here as well. And I think the topic this year that everyone talks about is also about upskilling right. uh, when it comes to AI. And what we're excited about is that just last week, we launched you know, our initiative that we call One Million Minds, you know, One Platform. And we have announced that for the next four years, we are committed to train a million people wow. around the world on everything related to kind of AI and the skills that you will need to really implement these initiatives you know, for your company and your organization. So, I think that uh, topic around, it's not about technology anymore. The technology is here, but it's also about you need to be able to work with that technology as well. You need more people who can, who can use it. Absolutely, training the next generation. Yes. Denise, as you look out on the coming year, what are you most excited about and how will the AI Data Cloud continue to lead the way for its ecosystem of partners and customers? Yeah, I think this year, looking now ahead, it's really about the real value deployment you know, of AI. Last year was very much around, everyone was experimenting around it, developing their data strategies so they can actually develop an AI strategy. This year, everyone is really uh, moving towards real value use cases. Right. And uh, it's just been exciting to see across our customer base, thousands of customers that have launched new AI initiatives that are truly driving you know, value to their organizations. You know, we're, to your point, we're very much past the AI hype cycle and now in the ROI and delivery of business outcomes. Yes. Denise, such a pleasure. Thank you so much for joining me Thank here today. Thank you, thanks. And for the audience watching, I'm Ryan Green with Data Cloud Now. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you soon.